Mpenzi mtazamaji kama ndio kwanza nafungua channel yako ya TFTV tafadhali subscribe ili wewe mwanzo kupata video zetu mbali mbali za ndani na nje ya nchi. Share video hii bila kusahau kudondosha komenti yako kwani ni muhimu sana. Agreement 3 on behalf of the Republic of Turkey, President of Tika, Abdullah Eren, on behalf of uh, United Republic of Tanzania, uh, January Yusuf Makamba, Minister, uh, they are going to uh, sign a memorandum of understanding between uh, Tika and uh, Tanzania, uh, Ministry of Cooperation and Eastern of uh, Africa, Diaspora Policy Area Cooperation Memorandum of Understanding will be signed. Agreement 4, on behalf of Republic of Turkey, President of Tika, Abdullah Eren, on behalf of uh, Tanzania, uh, Tanzania uh, Foreign Relations and Eastern Africa, January Yusuf Mamba, they are going to sign an agreement uh, between Tika and Tanzania uh, Ministry of Education, Science and Technology. They are going to sign the cooperation protocol in terms of higher education scholarships. Agreement 5 on behalf of uh, Republic of Turkey, Professor Dr. Uğur Ünal, and on behalf of Tanzania, uh, January Yusuf Makamba, Minister of Foreign Affairs and Eastern Africa, they are going to sign the protocol between the Republic of Turkey Presidency Archives and Tanzania United uh, Republic Archives Management Department. They are going to sign the cooperation protocol. Sixth agreement on behalf of Republic of uh, Turkey, uh, Erol Özvar, President of uh, Higher Education Council, and on behalf of Tanzania, January Yusuf Makamba, Minister of Foreign Affairs and East and Africa Cooperation. They are going to sign the agreement between Council of Higher Education of Republic of Turkey and uh, Tanzania, uh, Ministry of Science, Education and Technology. They are going to sign a cooperation agreement in higher education. The signature ceremony has ended. I leave the floor to the presidents for the press uh, release. Madam President, Honorable Ministers, Distinguished Members of the Press, I would like to welcome each and every one of you with my most heartfelt feelings. I am very pleased to welcome uh, the President of Tanzania, my dear sister Samia Suluhu Hassan in Turkey. Once again, I would like to welcome her and her distinguished delegation. And I would like to start 
by expressing how saddened I am over the flood and landslide disaster in Tanzania on April the 14th and the demise of eight primary school students in a traffic accident in Arusha. May them rest in peace. I wish patience to their grieving families and a speedy recovery to the injured. I believe that this first presidential visit from Tanzania to our country after 14 years will constitute a new milestone. Uh, I visited Tanzania in 2017, and Tanzania is one of the most important partners of our country in East Africa. Our relations are developing every day within the framework of mutual respect and win-win principle. During our talks today, we have discussed the cooperation between the two countries comprehensively. We have discussed the steps that can be taken to promote mutual trade and investments. Our bilateral trade volume has increased from $11 million in 2003 to $345 million last year. However, despite this increase, this current level do not reflect it does not reflect our real potential, and uh, we aim to increase uh, the trade volume to $1 billion in the first place, and we will intensify our efforts uh, on this in the coming period. Uh, the Turkey-Tanzania Business Forum to be held tomorrow in Istanbul with the participation of Madam President will be an important step in this respect. Turkish companies have successfully undertaken 14 projects in Tanzania so far, which are worth 6.4 billion US dollars. And Tanzania is the third country in Africa and the first country in sub-Saharan Africa in terms of total projects undertaken by Turkish contractors. Our companies have made significant investments in Tanzania in areas such as railway construction and modernization, ship, shipyard construction, shipbuilding, and road construction. It is a matter of pride for us that a large part of the standard gauge railway project, which will actually cover the entire country is being built by a Turkish company. Distinguished members of the press, we have also discussed uh, fight against terrorism uh, during our talks. Turkey does not discriminate between terrorist organization, organizations, and Tur Turkey has always attached importance to sharing its experience in this field with its friends. So, in this context, I have stated that we would be pleased to assist um, friendly Tanzania in taking steps to ensure its own security. And I have shared our uh, expectations from Tanzania in the fight against the FETO organization. And I have given information about the educational projects that our Maarif Foundation can undertake in Tanzania. And hopefully, we will see effective and concrete steps taken by the Tanzanian side after this visit. It is obvious that the coordination between the institution of the two countries should be further improved. Our foreign ministers have decided to take steps in order to initiate a high-level dialogue mechanism for regular political consultations. Distinguished guests, as you know, the African continent has always held a special place in my heart. Um, um, in, in, in my office as the Prime Minister and President, I have made more than 50 visits to the continent. And it is also a pleasure for me, for us, to see uh, that our Africa Af opening is welcomed uh, by the countries of the continent. 
and our deter determination to develop our relations uh, with the African continent in each and every field, from trade to education and agriculture to health remains. And we will keep contributing to making Africa's voice heard more on international platforms. Uh, the fact that our slogan, the world is greater than five, resonates with our African brothers and sisters, and this is a sign that we are on the right path. These sincere relations we have established strengthen our determination to fight against injustices in the world, especially in Gaza. Uh, the the uh, world knows how sensitive our African brothers and sisters are when it comes uh, to uh, the Gaza uh, uh, problem. And uh, in our discussions with Madam President, uh, we have discussed the steps that can be taken against the atrocities in the occupied Palestinian territories. And since the 7th of October, uh, more than uh, 34,000 Palestinians, children, women, elderly, and civilians have been killed by the Israeli forces. 75,000 ha has been injured. And for 195 days, uh, we have been witnessing one of the biggest massacres of the last century in, in Gaza. So we have to uh, work hard in order to stop the massacres in Gaza. There should be a uh, ceasefire as soon as possible. Uh, this ceasefire should be permanent, and then we need to take steps in order to resolve this issue by a two-state solution. And this week, uh, we have seen that Western countries have become one voice and talked against retaliation by Iran. Now, the same actors should become one voice and say, stop to Israel. Israel is trying to change the agenda, hide the violence in Gaza, and uh, Israel should not be led to do this. Uh, so uh, at the end of my words, I would like to thank Madam President once again for her visit. I hope that our talks today and six agreements signs, signed today um, will be auspicious for both countries. And I would like to send my best wishes and warmest greetings uh, to uh, my um, brothers, sisters, and friends in Africa and in other African countries, mainly in Tanzania. Thank you, Your Excellency. Uh, Your Excellency, uh, President of the Republic of Turkey, ministers, and senior government officials from Tanzania and Turkey, members of the press, ladies and gentlemen. Marhaba. I don't know how to, to reply on that. In my in my in my place we say Shika more than the elder said Marhaba. Yeah. Uh, I wish to thank you. Your Excellency President Erdogan for invitation and um, to thank the government and the people of Republic of Turkey for the exceptional reception accorded to us. I'm deeply grateful and honored to be in this beautiful country. I extend uh, sincere appreciation to you, Your Excellency, uh, for the just ended very productive meeting and for your commitment to reinforce the strong bonds of cooperation between our governments. Talking on diplomatic relations, um, I'll have uh, some few points to add. Uh, since my brother, President Erdogan, has covered most of what we have discussed. So what I can say is Tanzania um, retreat its commitment to enhancing the mutually beneficial relationship between our countries. Indeed, Turkey has been a valued partner and my visit here serves to underscore my commitment to cherish this partnership. But again, during our bilateral discussion, 
we noted with satisfaction substantial progress across various sectors. Broadly, our discussion focused on enhancing diplomatic and economic oppression, particularly in productive, um, in productive and social sectors, um, so as to um, facilitate the growth of our economies. On bilateral cooperation, I expressed our gratitude to the government of Turkey for its development cooperation and unwavering support to the education and health sectors in Tanzania, notably through critical investment in infrastructure and human capital development. Moreover, in solidifying our cooperation, today we have witnessed here the signing of six memoranda of understanding in the areas of higher education, economic diplomacy, and cultural cooperation. So in, this, uh, in the course of our discussion, I informed Mr. President about how Turkish expertise and know-how is already helping to transform Tanzania, including through the involvement in our flagship projects, such as the construction of the first standard gate railway linking Tanzania to other neighboring countries and has called Tanzania's commitment to ensure that these projects succeed and that the invested development gains are realized. Going forward, we have agreed that our ministers and teams of experts to meet and come up with a framework that can be used to strategize on the implementation of agreed upon areas of cooperation. And in this, Tanzania expressed readiness to host the Joint Economic Commission meeting on the dates mutually to be agreed upon. On promotion on trade, promotion of trade and investment, Tanzania envisages to engage with Turkey's private sector or private sector actors. And we'll be meeting tomorrow, as Mr. President said, in Istanbul. And the engagement will mainly focus on three key messages. And the first one is to tell them the positive impact Turkish investors and businesses are making in our country. And second is to underscore the favorable business and investment environment in Tanzania. And to explain on the strategic marketing position that Tanzania can offer and number three, the call for Turkish investors and companies to do more business with us, particularly in strategic sectors such as transport, blue economy, manufacturing, agriculture, and tourism. On global issues, President Erdogan and myself also exchanged views on important regional and global issues. Tanzania commends and supports Turkey's role in seeking Pacific settlement of international disputes. We retreat our call for an immediate cessation of hostilities in Palestine and unhindering humanitarian access to the people of Gaza. Um, we also uh, received uh, the condolence messages for the loss of uh, our late president from uh, President Erdogan, but also uh, for the loss of our school kids, eight of them who lost their life due to heavy rains. So the condolence messages are received, and thank you for condoling with us. Um, dear members of press, in conclusion, I once again express my gratitude to His Excellency um, Erdogan for the productive engagements we have just uh, we had today and fruitful deliberation that we have arrived at. I am confident that through our joint efforts, Tanzania and Turkey 
will continue to be the strong impactful partnership based on shared values. Lastly, I conclude by saying that mine is a reciprocal visit following a president, President Erdogan's visit in January 2017. In the need to further solidifying our cooperation, I have invited my brother, President Erdogan, to once again make a visit to Tanzania at his convenient time. And when I said it, he nodded the head like this. So that's, that was an acceptance of my invitation. So thank you very much. We, have, we are very grateful on this um, arrangement of our visit, official visit in uh, Ankara. We'll be heading to Istanbul tonight for the business meeting tomorrow. And I'm sure we are going to strike deals. Not a deal, but deals. Thank you very much. Among uh, the Tanzanian delegation, since we do not have any members of the press, we will not be receiving any questions. Uh, now, let us have a greeting with Madam President, and then we will proceed to dinner. TV na kupatia video mbali mbali kutoka ndani na nje ya nchi. Tafadhali endelea kutufuatilia kupitia channel yetu ya Tip TV, YouTube, Facebook, Twitter na Instagram. Bila kusahau kudondosha komenti yako kwani ni muhimu sana. Tip TV tupo kijamii zaidi.